The Jesuits and most religious congregations take the three vows of poverty, chastity and obedience. Well, now you would say I am not a Jesuit, so all these vows don't really apply to me. Well, but guess what? Each and every one of these vows makes sense for everyone, including you. So here are three reasons why the vow of poverty makes sense for everybody. The vow of poverty helps us to become aware of the human desire to acquire more material possessions. For example, are you happy with the mobile phone that you are using? It could be any one of these. But are you really happy? Isn't it true that you desire a slightly better one? Unfortunately, this desire of yours is never going to be fulfilled. Poverty means living in simplicity. Are you comfortable in sharing your material possessions with your friends? Or do you feel that you cannot live without them? Perhaps you have already developed an inordinate attachment to these possessions. The vow of poverty helps us to ensure that we control the gadgets instead of the gadgets controlling us. Lastly, the vow helps us to understand that happiness does not really depend on material possessions. One can be happy even living in simplicity. Haven't you experienced that already during this lockdown? Your happiness depends on your relationship with the people around you, your relationship with God and also your relationship with yourself. It would be clear to you by now that the vow of poverty does not mean to live in misery. On the contrary, we are called to ensure that all people live a dignified life with access to good food, clothing, shelter, education and employment opportunities. Well, that's three reasons why the vow of poverty is important for all of us. And I know what's going on in your head right now. It's my own money and I have worked hard for it. Can't I just spend it the way I want to? Of course, but is it also possible that we can expand our horizons from this I, me, myself perspective to look at also those who are lesser fortunate than us? Are you ready now to take the vow of poverty in your life?